Welcome, I'm Dr. Melina Roberts and I want to talk about histamine. Now a lot of people are familiar with histamine. Histamine is something that is naturally released from our body when we have an inflammatory response. It's released in response to that inflammation. It's usually in, in response to that local inflammation and it's mostly associated with that allergic reaction. And when we have that allergic reaction, we end up with an increase in that histamine level. And I want to talk about the difference between taking an antihistamine medication and taking a natural remedy that helps to naturally bring down histamine levels. Now, one of the big differences is that an antihistamine medication will block our histamine receptors. So we still have the histamine in the body and that histamine will continue to increase even when we're on that antihistamine medication. So then what happens is that once you stop that antihistamine medication, since you still have a buildup of the histamine within the body, once you stop that medication, then the histamine can now go into those histamine receptors and cause a reaction in the body. So when you come off of those medications, then the reaction that you had, sometimes it's an allergic reaction, sometimes it's like a rash happening in the body, then the reaction will just reappear once you come off of those antihistamine medications. Now on the other side, we have natural remedies that help to bring down those histamine levels so that you no longer have that histamine reaction. Now, there's remedies like a quercetin, and what the quercetin helps to do is it helps to stabilize mast cells which produce histamine so that we can naturally help to bring down those histamine levels. Another thing that we can do is that there's an enzyme that's produced within our gut lining called dianamase oxidase. And what it helps to do is it helps to process histamine and helps to naturally bring down those histamine levels. Now, if we have imbalances or damage to that gut wall, or the integrity of that gut wall, then we actually don't produce enough of this enzyme that helps to process those histamine levels. So what we need to do is we need to work on healing up the gut lining, we need to help support this enzyme, and by doing that, we help to control those histamine levels. So I hope that helps you to understand the difference between taking an antihistamine medication or taking a natural histamine reducing supplement. All right, so thank you so much for watching. I encourage you to share this with your friends and family, to press the like button, to make a comment below, and until next time, continue to learn, grow, and build health.